Hey everyone, how's it going? It is Memory here. We're here, everyone, ladies and gentlemen, for the 11th episode of How Not to Summon a Demon Lord. And in the previous episode, the big thing we had, obviously, was the revival, resurrection of Krebskulum. We also saw at the end of the previous episode that Sadler is out for revenge on Diablo. We also went into Alicia's character a little bit more uh, as well, and it seems like she was just, you know, mistreated by her parents, so that's why she kind of has, like, this grudge towards humans, I guess. So, uh, yeah, we're going to hop into this episode and see what we got. We only have a few more episodes to go, so we're going to get started. We're at the very beginning, zero seconds, and we're going to get started in three, two, one. Play. Big surprise. What is this? <laughs> yeah, what is that? Yeah, what, <laughs> what does that have to do with biscuits? Are, are they just taking like letters of the word and I guess so. Rem's like, nah, I'm good. <laughs> She's looking at her face. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> nice try. Nice. There she goes. <laughs> man, she really can't stand this. Alicia can't. <laughs> Jeez. Which, I mean... What we had in the previous episode, and I mean, even the opening, we we saw. I've meant to say to that so many times, but like, she's definitely like, I don't know if you want to say abused, mistreated by her parents, by her family, by humans. So that's why she, you know, so against the you know, wants the destruction of the mortal races, I guess. <laughs> so, which, from how I took it at the end of the previous episode, Sadler's like saying screw the whole thing about like the humans and mortal races. Like he just wants his revenge against Diablo so they have conflicting things going on there which I mean when we first saw Sadler and and Alicia like you know face to face I, I knew there was you know differences there and like ambitions opinions whatever so yeah which all I gotta say to to Sadler is good luck trying to take out Diablo <laughs> good luck man I mean the only way you can really try and get at Diablo is by getting the ones around him, like a, a, you know, a Rem or a Shara. But Alicia's going to have a, you know, pivotal position spot in the, you know, this final stretch of the episode. So we'll see what, what happens with her. But Krebs School, I'm not the, yeah, not what I was expecting with the resurrection, you know, like there wasn't even really a fight. It was just like, she has nothing or, you know, no desire to, harm the the mortal races or anything like that so they were all surprised by that i caught it was too but <laughs> oh what the hell was that did you see the look on alicia's face what the young girl awakens the title of the episode i like the little outfit she has too <laughs> like to kind of disguise herself while they're around in the city and all that because people would like flip freak So if she were to get those memories back, then maybe she would go off on the <laughs> on the mortal races. So that might be what they're well, Alicia, what Alicia is going for to get her back to those memories. She's definitely scheming, though. She's definitely plotting. Can't really trust her at all right now. <laughs> what? Where'd they all go? Oh no. Yeah, there's Alicia. She's scheming. She's plotting.
Yeah, she's trying to get her to that, the actual state I guess she should be in. Oh, no. This early in the episode, too? Like, already? Come on. It's always something. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's what she's saying. Not to them, really. Oh, no. Yeah, I knew it was going to come to this at some point. <laughs> Clem. <laughs> Oh my god. She's off the deep end. She's she lost it. But just because her parents are, you know, just, that doesn't mean all of the mortal races, you know, all, all the humans are, like, see, I don't get that. That's kind of stupid, but, <laughs> yeah, I mean, <laughs> oh my god, how pathetic. And now that Alicia's you know, kind of told that fake story, right? It's like now Rem's going to be occupied with this guy, with Sadler. You know, that's what Sadler's going to go after, too. Jeez. Protecting me is you. Yeah, good one, buddy. Good joke. <laughs> See, I, I don't I don't know. I don't really care for him or even Alicia, especially right now at this moment. <laughs> so is what we've saw before with her just like a the facade, like so it's not even ge like real or genuine at all. The kind of emotions we've saw are, you know, show. So Rem and Clem now in bad hands and bad. Oh, wait, did Clem get away? Oh. Oh, wait, maybe not. Okay, so they actually were captured. <laughs> she has biscuits on deck. She just, like, keeps them with her. <laughs>
That's what I was talking about. The only way they'd try and get at Diablo is, is something like this, too. Because she wasn't what you expected it to, to be. I, I mean, how could you... In this state that Clem's in right now, you you wouldn't want to hurt her, you know, or want her gone. At least I wouldn't. <laughs> they both, in their different ways, have... So sort of that sense of, of being alone. <laughs> hey, at a time like this, they gotta they gotta be there for each other. <laughs> Help out each other. Don't become a monster. <laughs> I say she still does it, though, because, I mean... <laughs> She'd still be the same, even if, even if she just decided to do that right now. Because if they don't do anything now, they're going to try and bring her to how she actually should be, apparently. And that would be terrible. Not good. Oh no. That's really what he thinks. He's like just sure that he thinks he's a freaking god, like himself, like or itself. <laughs> this guy needs a reality check. I thought he would have it from Diablo or something, but I guess Diablo's gonna have to show him again, or someone's gonna have to show him again. Don't, don't even think about it. She doesn't cooperate with anyone. She just does all this for her own, yeah, she does all this for her own, and she'll use whoever to, that's why she's been using Diablo, apparently. Because she sees him as a strong individual to progress with her. Look what it's led to. Look where we're at. So lame. So lame, dude. She just totally avoided that. You saw the look in her eyes, too. And that's what I was asking. Before, you know, the time she's helped and the time she's, like, shown emotion and all that. Like, was that fake or was that bullshit or actually genuine? And, like, she just ran out of there. Like, what are you doing, Alicia? What are you doing?
Oh, Emil and Sylvie. <laughs> it has never done this before. <laughs> I need your help. Let's do it. Come on, it's a meal. It's a meal. <laughs> it's a meal. And you're just making yourself act, you know, seem like you're acting way different anyway while doing this. Oh. Well, how convenient, how perfect. There we go. I well, didn't have to even say anything to him at all. <laughs> you know what meal's going. <laughs> you know what meal's going. The protector of all women. Whoa. The actual true resurrection of the Diablo is gonna get here before anything happens. There's no way. There's no way he won't. This guy's scum, he needs to die. <laughs> It's not as bad as Shara's brother or whatever, but come on. Oh, no. Come on, man. Oh. She's going to... Yo, Clem... Clem is gonna freak out. You see the look on her face? Yeah. Honestly, at this point, I would not care if she just went off on him. Yeah. She is pissed. She is pissed. Oh, boy. Please do. Please do. Please do. <laughs> Very fitting, yeah. Please, please. Oh, what are you doing, Rem? She could have easily probably deflected that attack or went against that attack. Like, there's no way. No. Why would you do that, Rem? They just had to pull something like that or do something like that. Are you kidding me? Oh my god, what is wrong with you, dude? Kill, please kill him. No, look at him. Stop, stop, what are you doing? Oh my god, like the freaking overkill. Oh boy. What did you expect? What did you expect? She was getting so ticked. Did you not even notice that? If Rem's somehow still alive, I mean, I, I bet she'll live somehow or she'll be okay. But that, yeah, that's just how these things go. But
Fuck you, Alicia. And fuck you, Sadler. Yeah, look at your face now, you fucking idiot. <laughs> I hope you die. Ter terrible death. <laughs> and I wouldn't even care if Alicia did, honestly, at this point. I would not. Like, look. Oh, the damn thing has a rack, too. <laughs> this form is pretty dope, though. I'm not going to lie. You're dead. You're dead. <laughs> Look at him. Look at him now. Uh, am I not God? Uh, I wonder. Dead. See ya. Never come back. And that the barrier is about to be just destroyed. And this is just gonna cause an all out, all out chaos. Jesus Christ. She'll be okay. She'll be okay. She better be okay. With you know, with the, with how these t shows usually go, she'll be okay. She'll she'll live. <laughs> she'll live. Yeah. <laughs> Who the hell do you think I am? With the biscuit. Just give it give her a biscuit. And so go back to normal. I bet that's what's gonna happen. <laughs> after after a long, you know, tiring fight, probably with this with this demon lord. <laughs> I mean this will this will definitely be the probably the toughest fight that Diablo's had to you know to this point. But even so, I, I, I think it has this in the bag, honestly. <laughs> Maybe with the biscuit. What if, what if, what if? Like what if? But, dude, I cannot stand Alicia right now. I cannot stand, I can't stand the Saddler. I couldn't stand him t to begin with, the Saddler guy. But, you know, Alicia, I, you know, the, I, I liked Alicia at first, you know, when we got her introduction and all that. And and now she's just, you know, who we're actually seeing the true or part of the true Alicia, I guess. Which, you know, it's just, a, it's such a dumb your thing what she's after <laughs> like okay because one or two people your parents or whoever you know abused you you tr mistreated you whatever it is you're gonna take it all out on everyone on all the humans or you know your, even your closest friends or who you know you thought or who we thought were her closest friends right <laughs> you know and, and all the all the humans all like you know how many innocent people are out there that this so so lame <laughs> But I mean, with the, with how these shows go, usually in the end, everything turns out okay. So you know, Rem's gonna live. Diablo will probably end up taking care of of Clem, right? And Clem will go back to hopefully the way she was before. <laughs> this, all, this all the biscuit, you know, loving, singing, you know, with everyone. But uh, for now, I guess, like Alicia said, hatred was all that was needed. You know, seeing Rem just be continually stabbed like that was the was the trigger. You know, so uh, we'll see what happens. I think we have what one more episode, two more episodes, something like that. But you know, if anyone can solve this problem, if anyone can get this straight, it's freaking Diablo. <laughs> so I'm not worried. I'm not really that worried. So. Yeah, let me know what you all thought of this episode of Demon Lord. If you did enjoy the video, make sure you drop a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you for watching. Peace.